everybody. I just want to share with you that I got this cute little book that I plan to make into a prayer journal. As you guys know, I love to have journals and diaries of all different kinds. Um, so I thought since I'm trying to become a better prayer warrior that I will write everything down so that I can not forget stuff and you can't pray for everything and everybody in one day. So this way I can maybe spread out all the topics over a week. So this is just a little generic, no brand uh, green binder that I bought. This is a A6 size or personal size. I'm not sure I've seen it called both things, but it's about five inches by seven inches. And I wanted to show you guys what I've put inside. I'm not sure if this is going to be my final layout, but I wanted to share before I start writing in it. So it's got a magnetic clasp, which I like. And then I've got these little tabs. I bought this kit. I'll link to all this on my Amazon. And it comes with these cute fluorescent tabs and these little clear rulers. And it's got a thing for a pen. All these things for cards or whatever you want to put in here, little notes and papers. And on my first page I've got this little um, things to remember. I might change the title, not sure I like that, but I, I do want to have a theme in here of warriors because of inspired by Ephesians 6 in the spiritual battle that we're in, the armor of God and everything like that. Okay, so that's my first page and then I have just a... Uh, a clear um, little envelope. It's like a ziplock. This little tab goes and you can open it. And I like that because I can put uh, notes or artwork and I'm probably I'm gonna put some kind of drawing in here and it uh, claims to be water resistant so that would be good. Okay so here are the tabs. My first one is praise so that'll be when I meditate and think about verses that I'm going to praise the Lord and talk, tell him how wonderful he is. And then I only have one page in all of these, but I'll fill these out, write down verses, probably draw artwork and maybe song lyrics in here. Next is Thanksgiving, because it's one thing I have always loved and done is giving thanks and being thankful for things and counting my blessings. So I will definitely be writing things down. There's so much to be thankful for. And then this is forgiveness. So uh, when I get to this section, I'll uh, be asking the Lord to forgive me of sins. We all sin and do the wrong things and we always will unfortunately but thank goodness for the blood of Jesus who's there to forgive us if we are truly sorry about what we've done okay then for me this is a section for personal prayers that I'll ask for myself and then this is for it says for my husband and family uh, what I did as I Chris had this great idea. These are just made of uh, cardstock. They're a harder paper. And I didn't want to write on the cute tabs and everything with a pen. Chris suggested I use washi tape, which is wonderful because washi tape peels right off. And if I want to change the heading and make it something else, I can just change it. Or if I spelled something wrong or the letters got bunched together like they did there, I can change it. So these will be prayers for Chris and uh, family members. Alright, then I've got, as is the current topic of this month on my channel, uh, USA and other nations. So I will definitely be praying for our president, our leaders, the United States, and then other countries like Israel and other nations that I are on my mind a lot. Section for pastors and spiritual leaders. This is for unsaved and prodigals people that I know that aren't Christians that I hope will turn to Christ and saved believers that have backslidden and become carnal and gone astray. Yes, people for some reason have the misconception that 
if you become a Christian, you automatically become this perfect angel. No. And it's very possible for saved Christians to be some of the most wicked, evil people out there, unfortunately, because we are still human and we're still stuck in these bodies. Which is why you have to ask for forgiveness and mean it and ask the Lord to help you and forgive your sins and really be sorry about and try to do your best. And then this section will be for when God answers my prayers. I will be writing down dates and say what he did for me and, and it should be very interesting to see. I've already got a few things lined up in here I want to write down that are just, just amazing. And then I got a blank one. I don't know. Maybe I'll make this prayer request if people ask me to pray for something and I'll write it down in there or, I don't know, leave it there for something else. And then I added the extra stuff that came with that kit. Just these little pouches. This one has two. Probably for more art. This is one of like a uh, driver's license holder type thing or business card. Again, same thing. I'll probably make artworks and little verses, things to write in there. And then extra pages, and I'm sure each section will have uh, plenty of pages. And then a big pocket right there. And I think there was a big pocket on the other side. Yeah, there's a big pocket here, too. Put my little tabs back. Oh, and there's a pen loop. I gotta get a pen just for this. Maybe, maybe I'll have the two pens there. Have uh, a typical black one, and then maybe one in my favorite turquoise blue. This pen writes in turquoise, not in that navy blue that you see those blue pens all the time. That's that yucky dark blue. This is this pretty, pretty blue. Uh, oh, and the idea for the, the tabs that I want to use is, um, like, I'll take, let's say, one of these arrow tabs, and then, uh, let's say we go to some a family member you wrote down. I'm just gonna make names up. Bob, Dave, Rick, whatever. And then you can put the tab, and you know you prayed for them, bring it down, because they're reusable stickies, then the next person, and then you know, close, you know, gotta go to the next section, then the next day you come back, where'd you leave off? And I think that's what's going to be the wonderful thing about using these reusable little tabs that way. Okay, so yes, I hope that this has been helpful and maybe some of you guys will uh, want to try to do something like this with your own journals. Hope you liked it. Des signing off.